I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw the U.S. map region, the southeast. Come over here to the left. We're going to draw a straight line down, straight line across, baby triangle, baby triangle, baby triangle, baby triangle. This is your compass rose. North, south, east, and west. I could not believe how many states are in the southeast. So follow along. Remember you got to kind of have a loosey-goosey kind of draw. Starting way over here on the right at the top put one dot and we are going to draw a straight line out, curve line down, curve line down, little curve line up, curve line up, and leave it floating. Because here comes another state. We're going to continue this little straight diagonal line up, curve line out, curve line in, curve line up, connect. Come back to this line where we started. We're just going to extend it a little bit and we're just going to draw a curve line down, wavy line, curve line up, straight line down, straight diagonal over, and connect. Come back up to the top, straight line over, straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, wavy wavy line leave it floating wavy line down wavy line up and connect now starting right here we draw a straight diagonal down straight line over wavy line up connect Starting back over on this side, right here at this point, we're going to draw a curve line up, wavy line up, wavy line down, wavy line over, straight line, curve line up, straight line, connect. Starting right here at this point, we draw a slightly wavy line down, wavy line over, curve line up, and connect. Come back over on the right side and we're just going to draw a wavy line down, wavy line up, straight line, connect. Starting right about here we draw a wavy line, wavy line up, connect. Starting right about here we draw a curve line in, Curve line down, little curve line up, straight line over, straight line up, curve line up, connect. Come back down here. Now let's go up a little bit. We're going to draw a straight diagonal down, straight diagonal down, little curve line up, little curve line up straight line over, connect. Now we're going to draw little curve line in, in, straight diagonal down, straight line in, little curve line. Now I'm going to crash into this curve line, jump over, curve line up, wavy wavy line, up, connect. I squished Florida, but it still works for me because we're doing this by hand. All right, now come all the way up here, right at this point, straight line out, straight diagonal up, straight line out, 
straight line down, little curve line, straight line over, leave it floating because right here we're going to draw a wavy line out, I mean down, straight diagonal down, wavy line up, wavy line up, curve line, connect. Now we can come in and draw that line connect. Come over to this space right here. We're just going to draw a wavy line down and out. Curve line over. Curve line up. Curve line down, down, up. Curve line down, up, connect. Wow, did we do it? We might have done it. All right, I can tell if I label it. This little guy right here, D-E-L for Delaware. This section here is Maryland, M-D. Then we go West Virginia, regular Virginia, Kentucky, these are abbreviations, Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, Georgia, Florida, my squished Florida, Alabama, Mississippi, Arkansas, Louisiana. Woo! That's a lot. All right. Just so you know, triangle, straight line. If you go straight up, you hit the northeast, which we will do presently. If you go straight up from Arkansas, you hit the Midwest. And if you go from Arkansas again, straight line, triangle, you hit the southwest very busy area. Okay? Alright, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, first off, I was so involved in drawing all my states, I forgot, hello, curve line, curve line, my body is of water. Curve line, curve line, and these are important because like on this section, this is the Atlantic Ocean, and this is why Florida and the East Coast gets hit with um, hurricanes and this section curve line curve line curve line is the Gulf of Mexico and that also generates a lot of weather activity these are big bodies of water curve line curve line alright the easy part about drawing a map you don't have to color in much so because this whole map is so crowded I'm taking my yellow and I'm just coloring in this whole entire land mass of 13 or 14 states, I forget. I'm coloring them all in yellow because it is a huge area with a lot of abbreviations and we want to be able to read it. Huge area. Okay. Next, equally as important, all these baby triangles because they show direction and they tell you information. So you'll do a better job than me. These are all colored in red. Your compass rose. Your directionals. Very important. And then, last but not least, blue green. For my Atlantic Ocean and my Gulf of Mexico. I think that's all. Let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my U.S. map region of the Southeast. A lot going on, lots of states. Okay, bye bye.